Dominic Monahan is with us. Uh, if you were to rate, start here, movie, 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 to be identified with, what would you say? On the street, what people yes. ask me about. Well, Lord of the Rings, probably. Then maybe Wolverine. A lot of people think I'm Hugh Jackman. Yes. I'm not sure why. I can see. That's why uh, we booked you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Where, and, then, and then Lost. I was going to say, where's Lost, Lost in there? Lost is in the middle. You know, uh, you do get rampant kind of fans. Well, the Lost people are crazed, though. We, the Lord of the Rings crazy. people are, might well, be a crazy. little crazy. I'm yeah. cool. I embrace the crazy. That's fine, you know. But yeah. I, you don't get that many opportunities in life for people to, like, scream at you in airports, you know. Yes. And people will scream at me, and, Charlie! <laughs> and what's really cool is, like, if I get on a plane, sometimes I make people nervous because they associate me with plane crashes. You yes, know, so that's right. I sit down and they're like, oh, no. Here it goes. No luck. And then they try and take a picture anyway, of selfie. This is entirely different. In this one, you play uh, the bad guy. Or misguided. Mm, misguided, thank you. In the new kids flick, is kids or family flick? What do we want to call this? Well, what do you think? You family. saw it last night. I adored it. Family, family okay. yeah. It's called uh, Molly Moon and the Incredible Book of Hypnotism. So he, you're trying to go after this magical book that this little orphan has, and here's all the crazy that happens. Professor, please. I've been looking for that book for a very long time. Can I ask you to keep your voice down? To I suggest you find it. Otherwise, Briarsville will be looking for a new librarian. Perhaps I was a little too hasty, Professor. Let me look That's again. That's it. That's the book. Hey, wait! You! Come back! So you embraced your inner nerd for that look. Huh? Yeah, I was actually looking at me there thinking maybe I should go back to that kind of slick, yeah, yeah, no. slightly no. Hitler moustache, <laughs> John Lennon glasses. Dominic? No, don't. You do, you're no, not I into it? So. Yeah. I don't okay. think so. Well, you'd know with that tie. Yeah. You're a style merchant. Yes, I'm a style merchant. Um, this thing that we should say in the storyline, there's a girl who discovers the secret. She, she finds the book. The book teaches her hypnosis that allows her to become a huge, incredible star. Yeah, she can kind of control adults a little bit. It's yes. a little uh, orphan Annie type story in a way. She's an orphan. She's not being treated very well. She gets this magical power and she uses it for good, you know. Meanwhile, my character is trying to get the book and use it for bad to get money and power, but she just wants to, like, make all her friends feel a little bit better. And your mom happens to be none other than... Joan Collins. <laughs> Joan Collins yes. was your mother. Joan Collins. Wow. That was great. It was so much fun hanging out with Joan Collins. I mean, she kind of, you know, classic diva. She kind of just breezes into set and does a thing and then Darling. breezes out, you know. She She'll, like, give you a hand to kiss it. I was like, yeah, I'll kiss your hand. And, <laughs> and she knows she's doing it when she does it. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. yeah exactly. All part of that. Now, in, in this thing, you so badly want the power of this book that you do something very dastardly mm -hmm. with the dog. Oh, what, what, what? I mean, there's a few things I do to the dog. Okay. Nothing illegal. <laughs> I wouldn't, I wouldn't but, but contemptible. Yeah, well, yeah, he does a few things. I mean, you know, he is that classic villain, and there's a very adorable little dog in it. I mean, I end up at one point, I think, like, waist deep in sewage. Yeah. Like, swilling out sewage, which is obviously not a fun. What I, what I like about this film is it almost has, like, a, a harking back to the movies like Mary Poppins and Bedno, Bedknobs and Broomsticks. My favorite, right? Did you things grow Things that up I with grew those? up with, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, there's nothing... There's nothing nasty about the film. There's nothing controversial. It's just a very sweet story for families to watch. And you can sit down as a parent and not feel like you're going to accidentally hear something that your kids shouldn't was hear. Was it you know? one single thing that made me feel uncomfortable? And this is based on, there were a series of books. Do yeah, you think there's a bunch of books. Would you be able, because your character, you think you'll be able to be in the next one? I would hope that if we do it again, my character is now in cahoots with Raffi's character, yeah, Molly Moon, and they, and they get together. And also... Uh, Emily Watson was in it, which is one of the major reasons why I did the movie. I mean, I, I went to New Zealand to do Lord of the Rings. Emily Watson was in Breaking the Waves. I don't know if you remember that movie. She was incredible well, that, in Breaking That the is the movie that brought her to our attention. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. She was amazing in that. So yes. I got the opportunity to sit around with Emily Watson for a few hours. You're doing all types of things. You're doing these movies. You still have the TV show that's come to, is it the Travel Channel Yeah, now? Wild Things on the Travel Channel now. So, you know, I, I asked you once, you were here for Wild Things, and I... <laughs> And I admire you for doing it, but I also ask you, what is wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> I do get that a lot, actually. Yeah, my parents keep asking me that. <laughs> um, I don't know. I just, I love animals, and I love adventure, and I love experience. And I love travel. I mean, for me, you know, I get spoiled. I get yes. paid to go around the world and look after these animals and, and you know, learn a little bit about them. You got a little animal on your desk. Oh, we right do. Now. Right there. You want to save it? What is no, that? he'll name it and what take is it that? home. What that is, is that? Well, to what be is fair, that? that is a baby cockroach. But leave it. Oh, leave it. So, Are you serious? So? Yeah, it's a little tiny juvenile cockroach. Let it do its thing. It's a German cockroach, that, not to be now, confused now, with the American most, cockroach. Most of obviously. us can't stand cockroaches, but you're fine with them. Yeah, I love cockroaches. I have a lot of admiration for them. If you cut off a cockroach's head, it will live for eight days and then starve to death. It doesn't need its head to survive. 
Incredible little creature. Th that's unbelievable knowledge. Um, Thank you. I, I go back it. to the what is wrong with you. Yeah. Uh, no. Yeah. Uh, in but you, you, you have certain things you're oh, interested oh, I, in, right? Actually, I love that you do this. Yeah. Uh, in Florida, they're called palmetto bugs. Right. And mm -hmm. it gives them a whole different public relations. It does. Aura, it right? makes them sweeter. I mean, I think all animals are sweet and they have, you know, something to contribute to the world. So that's cool. Okay. So we got that. I know okay. we have to let you go. Um, yes, Molly I'm Moon? shooting a movie right now. I've got to go uh, do a movie. I'm doing a film called uh, Pet with uh, Ksenia oh. Solo. Yeah. It's uh, scary, great fun. Right? So, yeah. It's, it is a little scary. It's the story of a guy who meets his high school crush and it all goes a bit weird. And you still live here most of the time. I live right? in Los Feliz. Nice. Beautiful okay. Los Feliz. We expect you to come around a little more often. I'll be here Anytime. tomorrow. Okay. No, not tomorrow. We don't, we're okay. Not here yeah. Saturday. So Molly Moon and the Incredible Book of Hypnotism is now playing in select theaters, including the AMC Rolling Hills 20 and Torrance, also available on demand. Go see it. Dominic, <laughs> as always, thank you so much. See you.